Hello Connexit family, welcome to Connexit training videos. Today in this video, I'll be showing you how you can leverage ChatGPT and use WhatsApp Cloud API to reply to your customer queries for your business. I'm going to take an e-commerce store example and how you can train ChatGPT and reply to their messages using WhatsApp. So let us do all this inside Connexit. So before you creating a workflow, make sure you authorize your uh, account inside Connexit that is to authorize WhatsApp Cloud API. So how to set up WhatsApp Cloud API, I had actually done a video so you guys can go ahead and check the complete video in our YouTube channel. So now I'm going to show you how you can authorize WhatsApp Cloud API. Just click on WhatsApp account and click on add account. It will ask you for token, which you will get it inside your developer account. Just copy that and paste inside connects it the phone number id copy here and paste it and similarly the business account id just copy that and paste it here and click on SN continue this will going to authorize whatsapp cloud api inside connects it so now let's authorize chat gpt so for authorizing chat gpt just need to search for open ai just click on the app and click on add account this will ask you for api token so same you will get it when you log into platform.openai.com under your name so you can just say like Weave API and create new secret key and copy that and paste inside Connexit and click on yes and continue this will going to authorize OpenAI inside Connexit so now we are done with our authentication so now let's move on to creating a workflow so let's start by creating a workflow create Connex so I'm going to name this as customer support with chat GPT and WhatsApp so first search for WhatsApp trigger you have to paste an webhook inside WhatsApp Cloud API so for this just drag and drop WhatsApp Cloud API and select the trigger as message notification copy the webhook URL based on the instructions given here so go ahead and paste the webhook url so i'll show you how to do that go to your business account and then click on configuration after clicking on configuration so just click on edit so paste your webhook url and add the token as connexit underscore token and before you click on verify and save so you have to make sure you click on capture webhook response this will enable connexit to capture the webhook response from your whatsapp cloud api so let's go ahead and click on verify and save so this will going to send a test response which at this moment you can see this so we don't require this response we have to get an actual response we will do this process again so once you did this make sure you subscribe for click on manage and you have to subscribe this messages tab so that whatsapp will going to send all the messages to that webhook whatever you have been placed so make sure you subscribe for that and now let's go ahead and capture the exact response which has been sent in whatsapp so what I'm going to do is, so I'm going to ask any questions, something like this. So this is all my queries. So I'll just say like, how can I contact you? So let me go ahead and paste that question. So I have to hit the capture webhook response. So before I am sending a question so let me send a question As, where is your store located yes I received my entry exact entry so that will be the inside my messages tab so 
can see my phone number and the message as well where is your store located so now we the important step what we are going to do is so we uh, will be training chat gpt so basically based on the our store information so sending prompt to chat gpt is very important so that is where all your uh, data will be residing so make sure you train it properly uh, like a prompt is like something you have to send train all your business information so for this i am going to use text formatter inside connect it so just drag and drop text formatter and select merge text option and give the query that is coming from your whatsapp and make sure you write something like this so here what i'm going to do is so i just written is so you can see like provide the most friendly meaningful helpful short two line reply to the e-commerce store customer that is my store customers questions which is so i'm gonna write the question so which i'm getting it from whatsapp and based on the information so where i had given the store location store opening hours and the store location you can see that and also i am sending something some information on estimated date of delivery and product price and you know is there any cod basically the faqs i just given all the details so you can actually add your store details so sending the prompt uh, is like means basically you are asking open ai or chat gpt about the specific questions so this is very important and plays a major role so just click on validate this will validate the message inside text formatter so now what we will do is we will going to use open ai that is chat gpt so just drag and drop open ai and select as chat gpt select the ai model so you can have an option to select both the models so i'll just select the basic model and give the prompt and just it on test and review so this will give me the content the reply for my user question so i just asked for where is your store located it has given me the content so you can see thank you for asking we are located at the address and also it give me the map link as well so basically i had given this particular details so it is giving me all these details so now what i am going to do is i am going to send an whatsapp message which is very simple so just drag and drop whatsapp cloud api account and then select my whatsapp account and select the action as send text message and it will ask you for the phone number which we received from whatsapp itself the user number and then the reply which we got it from open ai so just hit on to that and hit on test and review so yes i just received an whatsapp message so you can see that so i asked for where is your store located and it says me thank you for asking so we are located at the address and it actually give me the map link as well so now my whatsapp bot is ready like you know asking uh, answering the questions from chat gpt so now we will go ahead and publish our connect this i'm going to rearrange all my app so i'm done so now i'll click publish so now based on the user queries my whatsapp is ready to reply for all the user queries on my e-commerce store so now let's go ahead and test this so i will start asking couple of questions so now i will start ask like so already as where is your store located so now let me ask another question like is cod available So yes, you can see it, it is actually saying, hi there, unfortunately, we do not offer CVD.